first official episode of gear. Okay, first let's start with the bike. This is a Bianchi Pista frame, which I bought from my friend. Uh, this is a full fixed gear brakeless setup. There's nothing on this bike that doesn't need to be. Uh, this here is uh, a tail light setup that's made by Light Skin this seat post that has batteries inside and these LEDs on the outside. This is really good because you don't have an actual external physical light that comes off. It's built into the seat post, so nobody can steal it. It's, it's just, it's here. You need to take off the whole seat post. Pedals, chain, I have basically lock pedals. I have the lock shoes, Shimano lock shoes with the uh, Shimano SPD. Uh, lock pedals on the bike here. I got really tired of the straps uh, that go around shoes because uh, my shoes just always end up getting ruined and so I just gave up and now I wear these. This is uh, an LS2 uh, helmet that I found on Amazon. It was like 50 bucks and uh, I put in myself, these are Koss uh, headphones, and uh, they're very inexpensive. I think they cost about like 20 bucks. But I sewed them into the, I stitched them into the, into the helmet lining there. And then I connected them. I also ordered this on Amazon, this little Bluetooth module. It cost also about 25 bucks and uh, it's connected to that. So this connects to my phone and uh, then I can, it also has a mic in it as well. I don't know if you can see the little hole there, but that's a mic so that I can actually answer the phone to in the helmet, as well as listen to music and uh, talk to Siri and you know, all that stuff. The little American flag uh, sticker on the back is my own customization. This also has the uh, pull down visor. Uh, this is really good for the winter. It keeps the wind out of my eyes and the rain and the sun. Um, that's the main reason I bought this helmet is because it doesn't have all the vent holes in the top like most bike helmets do, uh, which let all of that, you know, minus 15 Celsius and wind into the into the helmet, my head would get brain freeze. Uh, the next piece of gear I'm gonna show you is my bag. This bag is about 10 years old. This is a Hoglofs, uh, the model is tight, extra large. Uh, I like that it's big, it's a really big bag. I can fit all my stuff in here for the day, clothes, lunch, uh, laptop. This has these these uh, frame pieces in here. So uh, the bag structure is really rigid and uh, it supports really well. It's not at all this kind of flimsy bag. Uh, it also has these ratchet straps on the side where I can tighten down the whole bag. So if, the, if it's not completely full, I can ratchet the whole thing down super tight that nothing moves around in here. And I can run with it, I can bike with it, and it just, it's comfortable. It just, nothing moves. Uh, the straps are very good, very padded. It has these, this waist strap that I always use when I bike. And uh, it's, it's got the padding as well. Uh, let's see, this is, that's where my GoPro lives, right there on the front strap. Has this outside pocket here as well. And uh, I like to attach these big uh, tabs 
on the zippers so that I can grab it with gloves and just pull it right open. But uh, I keep all my tools in this outside pocket and my lock. Okay, but those are the things that I use and if somebody uh, has any ideas of ways that these things could be improved, um, please leave comments below in the comment section of this video. Um, I'd love to hear about ways that my life and my routines could be improved, so feel free to leave comments below. Mm -hmm.